Good morning, good morning. We're off to the car boot this morning. Um, unfortunately, the sound's going to be a bit funny because I'll be wearing one of these and I've got to wear it at the car boot. I can't wear it in the car, no point. But we are heading off to the Corn Exchange car boot sale this morning. I've had good reports about it. It's supposed to be quite busy, so I'm looking forward to it and seeing some of my old friends from the car boot and seeing what we can find, see what treasures we can discover at the new car boot at the Corn Exchange. It's quite difficult to get in at the moment because they've got a beer garden at the front of the Corn Exchange where they used to have the car park. They've got a big marquee set up there and they're going to be um, opening the entrance at the back of the car boot. So if you go to the car boot at the Corn Exchange, go to the back entrance of the car boot. Okay, so it's going to take us about 15 minutes. I'll see you in there. Well, we're at the Corn Exchange car boot sale this morning. We've got to come in through the back gate now, but it looks like there's plenty of cars. Hopefully we'll find something interesting. I'll see you when we find the first item. There's a lot of tables here and it's quite busy with buyers and sellers. I've never loved you with all the old bikes, but I'm not... Put my eyes on the chain, didn't I? I have to see it again, it'll have a helmet or something. Right. That's why I get to see it. I think the eyes are just trained, I don't know if I see it. Thank you. I used to have that book. Did you? Mm-hmm. I used to draw as well, but no more. That's weird that somebody would make a necklace out of buttons. I don't think it's a necklace, I think it's just it's keeping them together. It's got a wee fastener. It's got a good wee fastener on it too. They've went to a lot of trouble to do that. Look at that wee fastener. It's weird how they would do that, and that's mm -hmm. that's why. Each to their own, I suppose. Eh? Well, that's it. Do, 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 do. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I've not bought a thing yet. Not a thing. It's got to happen though. <laughs> well, did I, buy, I did buy a bought hand gel. That's what I bought. Big spender. Okay. That looks like a is it a George the second gaming token or two? No, they're Chinese. Yeah, well, that's a gaming token. Seventeen something. I found three in a wee hoard. Seventeen ninety. And I feel die. Seven is it? Is it seventeen ninety? Five pounds each. Yeah, I can't even see it with us. That is seventeen ninety. Yeah, the Irish ones are quite good to get. But, but I'm more interested. Much of these Chinese ones. Three quid. Three quid. That seems reasonable yeah. for Chinese coins that we know nothing about. 
one of the one of the things we know nothing about is Chinese coins. Somebody, somebody, somebody does, and he's making a fortune because <coughs> you see them. Mm -hmm. yeah. You see them kicking about. I might come back for them just to take a chance. I think you should. You know, like Ava, take yeah. a chance. So me. Seriously, I've no checked for this money. Yet. No, no, I mean. Ten pound coin. I just reckon it's two hundred years old. It's a ten. Aye. It's as simple as that. It's a ten to somebody that somebody wants. Somebody just said to me, "That's going to spend on fucking idiot." It's a ten to somebody that wants to hold an ice. I've not got the time to check ever. Two hundred year old coin. Two hundred and thirty. Stop swearing, man. Jesus, it's almost Sunday. That's Saturday, so it's okay. <laughs> <laughs> A happy smile from Newcastle on Tyne, eh? That's nice, that. Uh. They're probably we. She, she's well known, I can that much. Ah, the woman that does these? Aye. Uh, uh, Lucy Atwell. Lucy Atwell. Lucy Atwell, what did she do? Postcards. <laughs> she did something really famous. Well, let me find out. Some of them are quite funny. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> now, if you have got the HMS Rodney here, I would take it. And it wouldn't matter what you asked me for it. But you don't have the Rodney yet. Cutty sack. I've been on the new one. It's no longer new. No, I've got a great tale about the Rodney, the HMS Rodney of that era. The last man to be hung in the Navy was hung in the Rodney. 1736. Wonder if the, Glo the Gloucester was in the harbour at the same time. He was hung, and they took. There was about ten ships. No, they hung him because he killed the bosun. Supposedly killed the bosun on the, the Rodney, and they took a man from each ship to hoist him up on the main sail on the HMS Rodney. So it's, nobody could be accused of killing him. So it was a man for each ship, rather than somebody for just one ship, and they all get blamed. But that was good. Shame, because he never killed the bosun. What, he was innocent? He was innocent. He's now, they tried to make him a saint. Um, the Maltese, Maltese people, because he was hung in the Grand Harbour in Malta. The Maltese people found his grave and uh, investigated the, the whole thing. Yeah. Found out they never did it. God knows how they managed to find that out, but... They did indeed. While I'm here, I'm going to give a shout out to some of my new subscribers. I think it's Margaret Pipes, Hi B, Skipper Do, Gone Detecting UK. That's just, I think he's just got a new channel. Cadbury's Clicks, The Ninja Diggers, The Mental Detectorist, that's a great name. Thanks to everybody who's recently subscribed and all my past subscribers, really appreciate it. You might see the end of the street. What did you say that was? And thanks to a lot of my subscribers who've been purchasing stuff from my eBay and my Etsy account. I really appreciate it. And Lynn, I've sent you a nice wee extra thing in your latest parcel. I really do mean it. It's great to have everybody's support. It's much appreciated. So let's get back to the car boot sale and see what else we can find.
Watch your tapes. Can we see Cody? Should I turn off the light? Mm. Can he get up? How much is it to get back up? Are you alright? Are you alright? I am fine. Just getting old. I thought it was thinny film, but it's it's just the tape. Which is fine. <sighs> I like a good rummage. Oh aye, everybody does mate, that's what it's all about. You yeah. never know what you're going to find. Yeah. You never can tell. You don't have any sunny film, do you? Super stuff. Car boot sale, but not as we know it. <laughs> well, this is a this is a new drone, but different. The new drone. Uh, that goes hard there. It's not easy. Nobody recognises them there. Maybe not a bad thing. Maybe. Maybe. I'm not noticing any real. Problem with it, mind you, no getting recognised. That's right, aye. Nearly lost my glasses. Is there anything in this? No cars. You don't have the cars for the scale electric. They will go. Nah. No, first to go, eh? Always, always. So, there's a lot of tables here and it's quite busy with buyers and sellers. Thank you. 
I tend to get carried away and forget that I'm supposed to be commenting on these things that I'm finding. Guitar, but only one at six and one at four or five or three. Nice. See you later. It was nice seeing you again. Even though it was for such a short brief time. So am I. My goodness. The people you meet at car boots so. Got a good set of lungs out, lad, yeah? Oh, too good. Alright, not used to this kind of racket. Yeah. <laughs> I don't even know what it, I was running really stall, I don't, still don't know what he was selling. <laughs> Oh, do you live here as well? Cheers. Did you speak to my brother? Ah, right. No. No, nice, just nice, nice, nice this, guy. This table's nice like a wee magnet to me. A magnet? I wait for the good folks coming out. Aye, I wait for the good gear to come out. Wait in the good gear. No, 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 I didn't get the good stuff. I just. Do you know? I like buy, buying rubbish. I've had nice stuff. I've never had good stuff, but I've had nice stuff. Okay. Oh, okay. I've, I've, I've had you know, some really good stuff. Well, of course it's good stuff. Right. Uh, stuff. The Rolex is good. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Listen, you tell me anyway. Right. You did the same to me, funnily enough. Right. Well, Patek Philippe said they were rubbish. That's the one you tried on a Sunday. The Sunday is the price is three pounds. Yeah, I'm just clearing it. One good. My wife. Yeah. Oh, I wish I'd get some good me back bags. Can you? Because they're so strict. She's only allowed her allowance. Is it? Which is five packs of bags. Aye. Well. I just asked anyone else at the uh, staff, uh -huh. has anyone gone for a vacuum? Aye, 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 aye. Because uh, usually she gets one of the other ones. Aye, to get it for that. Aye, to get it for that. 
Well, this is your wee marlings. The mailers are found each for the wee ones. How much? A pound each for the wee ones. How many? How much? Eight pounds, love. And you know what, Mr. Shaw? I get a lot of twice. Oh. Twenty-five, twenty. Ten. Well, you see, Maggie, she's got weight, ten. 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 Generally, I was aiming to do the whole lot together, to be honest. But, uh, have a look, anyway. Records, not my thing. Amy's lost his pipe. It's a shame he's lost his pipe, huh? What's that? What's he lost? His pipe. Or cigarette. Was a pipe, was it? It's either a pipe or a cigarette. Or just a chip, is it? Is that a pipe or something? Looks too round to just be yeah. a wee chip. That's a shame. I hate these Scotty Ducks. Yeah, well, I probably go with you now, but... I literally hate them. <laughs> if that's just a wee chip, it's just a wee chip. It's just a wee, a wee colour. How much is that? A wee embellishment. Uh, three pounds. Three? Yeah. Three pounds a few. There's a few pairs in there, I think. I'm looking to make some up. How much are your wee carrots? Uh, three pounds. Mm, I think they... Fancy that? Fiver for the two diamond there, that? No. How much is one? Nice, no. For three? Three, fiver. Five? Five. Three? No, four quid I'm doing for. Burnness Maker. Elgin. What yeah, a nice wee, um, uh -huh. Oh, it's a Token horse. Of some sort, or it's come off something? Or? Possible horse grass. Right. How much is it? All uh, five. Five. You okay with that? Yeah. And a wee horse brass? Three quid. I'm doing well with the threes. <laughs> it's all three. It's all threes. <laughs> three for three. Not all three. I need three. Some of it's more. I right, wait a minute. I'll make it more. <laughs> Here you go. Okay. Well, new bag for you for a buy with a room. It's a big sports bag. Five pounds. Got a box of them over there. What are these? I've got different two different colours as well. Much of your pants. These ones are seven pounds, the ones at the front are all five of each. Oh. Alright, actually. I've no, got I a big double one. one. Oh, no, one. Eh? That's you, I get people coming yeah. up here they, they buy bloody twenty out of uh, them. And your lights? Now the lights, uh, the waterproof ones are eight pound. The non-waterproof ones are a fiver. See, everybody keeps telling us a woman keeps going up every week saying your prices are too cheap. Put them up, put them up. I said, well, why are you telling me to put them up? You just buy it bloody cheap. Eh, uh, just buy it. There's people buy these off me and then sell them. And these lights as well. There's one uh -huh. guy takes orders off everybody in his bloody neighbourhood. I can see it, right?
Yeah, that one, yeah. Yeah. Well, this one, this is shape of a book. Yeah, but it's quite heavy as well, that one. Yeah. Five of the ones at the front. Super stuff. Orange jazz. With me. <laughs> I didn't recognise you behind it. I know. I'm getting ready to perform an operation. Yeah. Any day. There's a book behind you, I've got an idea of what you're going to do. Any day. Oh, yeah. I'll get to know my incredible human body. I can't even get it open, never mind then. <laughs> Oh my god, he's in his underpants! <laughs> oh, it goes all the way through. Oh, it's quite an unusual painting. And that one. Uh, more of a print, I think. Nice though. That's nice. Ba -ba -ba -ba. Well, unusual, it's actually a painting. Well, it's a print of a painting. It's square, eh? I don't know, no. Is it London, maybe? Yeah, London, is it? Yeah, because... I mean, it's probably Ikea or something, but it's... Oh, isn't it a painting? That is America, look at the cops. It's unusual. Not your normal scene anyway. Super stuff. At least you can get a seat here. <laughs> if I had a heart. <laughs> da, 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 da. Who sang that? Eh? Who sang that? That was so black. Indeed it was. So you must be the same age as me, Jazz. And I'm pushing on 60... more than the time I know. Did I get my pension? Same as more! Mm. I think I'm going to end it. Found each two for one fifty. Just seen if it's the liquidy one or the, the actual gel you take one. All right, I'll take them. Two for one fifty. Yeah, I've got no, it up if you want. There's still there that place at the Falkirk. Oh, is it Falkirk? Aye. Yeah. They're I saying Sterling's it. really good. Sterling? Oh, yeah. Aye. The lady next to me last week said it was. Oh, I I don't know either. I don't know either. I know nothing. I know nothing. Oh, it's one of them, uh, where is that? Uh, oh, me too. A Bart Simpson mirror, I've never seen one in my life. No, it's got a TV. It's a TV? Yeah. Television. Oh, for a child. That is mental. Oh my God. TV. Mm. For a child, eh? Yeah. Well, you would hope it was for a child. Well, you, you don't know. For a big child. <laughs> it's probably his. Yeah. 
So <laughs> they're going for the cat. So. <laughs> so. I can show it to have it double your price. All right. Are you? All right, aye. Yeah. So we've been hiding. Oh. Indoors, I have the elves. Have you all been working? In my air raid shelter. <laughs> Try to keep away, yeah. you know. I went him. I checked more than half about that lamp. She was right, I'm keeping it. What marbles are the, worth the most? Yeah, we see. can never tell. No. I didn't care either. These I would ones. imagine. These ones. It's not an easy one. I would imagine him. I don't know. I've never heard. It'll be the solid, the solid colour ones. Maybe. I don't know. I know about certain things, but I don't know about marbles. I know nothing about marbles. No, I've lost a few in oh, my well, time. I was just going to say that. I've say mine's just lost it. <laughs> 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 Oops. I have one of these little sets. Got a set very like that. Oh, my. It's, um... They're nice. Yes, pewter. Yeah, aye. I've got a full set with the sugar bowl and everything. Mm, mm. Oh, oh, kicking things over. What have we got in here? Money, foreign money. Foreign money. Something like our money. Mm. Not worth a lot. <laughs> Not worth a lot, no, no. Hiya, hiya. Oh, good morning, morning. I'm good, I'm good. <laughs> Beautiful junk, Norm. It is. Beautiful. It's always a pleasure to see it's you. It's called Roosh, it's called Roosh non resale. How much is that a pound? Roosh. <laughs> Roosh. Well done. I've all about 97 pounds to go to get to my target. Oh, brilliant. That's alright. That is it. Could be worse. <laughs> Could be 98. <laughs> uh, You're doing fine. We're living the dream. We're living the dream. We're living the dream. No. I don't know, it might even be a nightmare though. Andy, you want to blow your fuses in your house? That one. Yeah. Two pounds, please. Lovely, thanking you. Mm -hmm. He looks old, but is he new? He's new. Yeah. Hello. Four pounds. Four. They know how to make them look old, huh? Hi, yeah. No, he's brand spanking. Yeah. yeah, I saw the label and I thought he can't be. No. <laughs> These are great prints. This is a print of the Norloch just beneath the castle in Edinburgh. That was filled in way back in the 1700s and it's now Princes Street Gardens and Waverley Station. It's just between North Bridge, I think, and Princes Street. The other ones. Five somewhere. And they're nice prints anyway. Sorry, I'm going to have to cut that video into two parts. I just get carried away and there's too much to see. So come back and see if I buy these nice um, nest the tables or if I get this lovely 1950s desk and chair. Let's see what we find in the car boot on part two. If you're not already a subscriber hit the notification bell so you don't miss the second part of this video and remember and hit that subscribe button if you're not already a subscriber and also have a wee look at my Etsy and eBay accounts which will be linked below and have a wee look and see if there's anything there that interests you things that I've either dug up or I've found at the car boot sale or in other many treasure hunts that I've done throughout the last year. Take care, I'll see you soon, have fun, stay safe this week, stay well and I'll see you soon. Bye.
some of it's more. Aye, wait a minute. 